recovery is such a big topic because people don't really recover anymore. I, I worked out hard, but now you walk away and you're so sore that you can't even work out the next day. You also have to work through the pain. If you work through the pain, say you work out, you're sore the next day, you go in to work out 15, 20 minutes into the workout, that soreness is gone. Now there'll be a little bit of soreness the next day and residue soreness probably oh. throughout the first week. But if you go in there and kill it and then don't work out again, you'll be sore for two weeks yeah. and you won't recover. The muscle soreness is gonna to happen to anybody that hasn't worked out in a long time. However, when you do work out hard, and there's a lot of people that do, they, they'll, they'll be in the gym for 90 minutes, two hours, and then they'll walk away from the gym. They're dripped in sweat, they've worked so hard, and then they won't eat anything. They think, I'm trying to lose weight, and they won't do anything. And that's probably one of the worst things you can do because you just expended all this sugar, all this glycogen storage, and all the protein in your own body. If you don't replenish it, immediately, your body will feel that depletion in a sense of soreness, fatigue, even nauseousness. So nutrition is 90% of the work, whether that's a shake, whether that's a sensible meal, but that's part of the process.